Итак, знакомьтесь, крест в синем углу, Фаби Гаудондо, Блу Коннор. СУ-3, 23 года. Рост 173 сантиметра, вес 65 и 95 сотых килограмма. Его стиль борьба на профессиональный рекорд. 9 побед, ни одного поражения. Ladies and gentlemen, he's 23 years old, standing 173 сантиметра стол. Official weight 65.95 kilos. As a wrestler, with professional record, nine victories and no losses. Из Махачкалы, Россия, настоящий поражений. Ислам! Хайден Гаудон, Торрет Коннор, бойцу 23 года, рост 173 сантиметра, вес 66 и 15 сотых килограмма. Его стиль ударная техника, профессиональный рекорд, 10 побед и только одно поражение. Ladies and gentlemen, he's 23 years old, standing 173 сантиметров tall, feature weight 66.15 kilos. As a striker, with professional record, 10 victories and only one defeat. Is Nalchika Rasia, Patam, Piber, Tomhena. And the referee in charge, Lukas Basatsky. Lukas Basatsky is the referee in charge of this anticipated bout. Piber Tomhenov, younger brother of Albert Tomhenov, the ex UFC fighter, against Ready. Islam Amarov. Fight. Well, to my mind, one of these two is a future contender. That's no for doubt sure. about that. Well, this is the classical opposition between the wrestler and the striker because uh, Islam Amarov has a wrestling background. And as for Biber Tumenov, just like you heard, he's a striker, he's a boxer. And actually, there are no many boxers in MMA, as we know. Peter Yan, only Peter Yan. And there, there are several kickboxers. Kickboxers of like course. Israel Adesanya and many, many others. But speaking about boxing, you are definitely right. There are very few fighters that actually came to MMA from boxing. And oh, the connection. Nice take down defense shown by Biba Tumenov. And by the way, uh, Islam Amarov has a pretty good amateur background because he is the amateur European MMA champion. And uh, it was in Guadalajara several years ago. It was in 2018, as far as I remember. And it was a big triumph for the Russian national team when they secured seven golden medals during this tournament. What an exchange here. And actually, it seems to me that Amarov is ready to go as a striker well, for uh, some moments. Look at this nice high kick. Nice head kick attempt, but perfectly blocked by Biber Tsuminov. And now we see that Islam tries to use his hand speed, tries to use some fake moves. And a front kick from Islam Amarov. And I think that Biber Tsuminov is looking for a big shot. He's not in a rush and just seeking for a right moment to strike and to catch the opponent with a dead shot, so to say, because we all do know that he's able to put you to sleep. A nice, what connection. A nice connection. Perfect landing from Islam Amarov. And another one good thing that he's doing now, that he continues yeah. to move. He's not standing in front of big hitter like Bibet Tuminov. He tries to move, he tries to confuse him with his, uh, with the changing of directions of his moves, some fins, some fake moves, some rolls with the punches. Nice leg kick to the calf. And Amarov seems to me a little bit faster yes, than yes, Amarov. Yes, exactly. What a oh. nice one-two by Amarov. Splendid, splendid job by Islam Amarov. Well, actually, as for me, in this fight, before this fight, I consider Bibet Zumina to be a favorite of his belt as a striker. Of, because of his striker. strong performances. But now we see that Islam Amarov came, stepped into the cage, well prepared for this particular opponent. And so far, for me, I think that he is winning the round. Yeah, I think definitely so. Definitely he's winning the round. He connected more, delivered more, and right now he tries to 
take his opponent down. Nice control is shown by Islam Amarov here. And I think the problem with uh, Tumenov was because he was waiting for the takedowns. He was controlling the distance and waiting for the takedowns, and that's why he took some punches. He didn't see it. Excellent takedown by Islam Amarov. And now he gets the opponent's back. Good control and the big knee to the hip of Bibek Suminov. And one minute and five seconds to go in the first round. Hey, take this end off. And as you can see, Amarov tries to drain his hips right now. Well, in what this, a strategy. In this particular moment, this is the only thing he can do. But still, he needs... He wants to produce as much damage as he can. And so that is exactly what he does. And you hear the crowd. There are lots of fans of Islam Amarov here that support him, that shout, Islam, Islam. This third, first round extracts a heavy toll for Tumenov. Look at Islam Amarov's move. He tries to hurt the calf of Bibet Suminov. Tries to ruin move, it move, and don't move. Stop. One point. Red corner. Grabbing the fence. And you see that Bibet Tumenov has been deducted a point for grabbing the fence. And the fight resumes. And so this round ends with 10 8. 10 8. Yes. Yes. Well, for me, it's pretty unexpected. Well, and I did not even expect that uh, Islam Amarov will provide such kind of a smart work that he did not step into the uh, exchange of with uh, Bibet Tsuminov. He did not. He did not get a single shot from him yeah. because the only one can be decisive and can knock. Uh, he, the only one shot from Bibet Tsuminov can knock you out, can put you to sleep. So that is exactly what Islam Amarov needed to avoid, and he really did it. Yes, he avoided punches. He was very sharp. He was ready to go as a striker. He did everything right. And actually, he took him down. And Bieber seemed to be really ready for, for the takedown attempts of his opponent. But he, was, he wasn't really ready for uh, a striking game of Islam Amarov. And uh, that definitely no. surprised him in the first round. David, don't you think that uh, Bibet Tsuminov could Two. underestimate Islam Amarov? I don't think he, that he underestimated him. I think he was preparing for a, a wrestler, definitely only a wrestler, not a striker. Excellent combination from Islam Amarov once again. And look at his defensive move after his combinations. He is not standing in front of the opponent. He's not waiting the opponent to counter. What a nice connection by Amarov. And perfect footwork once again. Moving, yes. moving, moving. Connected at move. Look at that. Perfect work by but, Amarov. But Islam Amarov should stay aware of these big shots because of only course. one connection from Bibi Tuminov can decide. So that's why Islam Amarov needs to work, needs to and I think that is a perfect moment for Amarov to take his opponent down because Tumenov right now is ready to go. He wants oh! his exchange and he delivered that. Big shot from Bibet Tumenov, but Islam Amarov managed to survive it. Now he creates, he creates this clinch. Perfectly done by Islam Amarov because it was a great moment for Bibet Tumenov to stun the opponent, to hurt him. You okay? You okay? Right now is a perfect time for Amarov to take him down, to try to do it. And it was an illegal hit to the back of the head from Bibet Tsuminov, but Islam Amarov happily is okay, and they continue struggling, and Islam Amarov continues to stay in control in this position. Tsuminov needs to separate in order to produce his big shots. Yes, he was, he was ready to raise the tempo of this fight. He wanted to strike. But as you can see, Amarov uses his wrestling skills in the second splendid. round. Splendid. Very just, smart move. Just splendid, David. I can't but admire this young man who sticks to the plan. Uh, and it was a perfect game plan to Take fight Bibi Tsuminov, this big hitter. Take and uh, do Islam Amarov, Amarov follows this plan moment after moment. Yes, Amarov surprised his opponent. 
twice well, in I the first round. Well, I think that shocked him. Yeah, Somehow. he shot him, definitely. In the first round, he showed him by his striking game, striking game, and in the second, by his wrestling game. That what uh, Tumenov was expecting in the first round, he showed in the second. And in the second, what he was expecting, he showed in the first. And we see that Biba Tumenov continues to grab the fans, and uh, it's forbidden. We remind you that it is under rules, and so if oh, good knee, good knee to the head from Islam Amara, who continues dominating and controlling the opponent in this position, not letting him out. Right now, controls the body, tries to hold him a little bit, and Manov tries to separate, and he needs to do it. He yes. needs, but look at this. Look at this pressure from Islam Amara. So Still seems, uh, if we look at these two youngsters, for me, Islam Amara seems to be smaller. Maybe even not this way category. Uh, speaking about uh, Biber Tumenov, but still, he's strong enough to stay in control and not to, uh, not to let Biber Tumenov to do anything. Just anything, because during these two rounds, but almost these two rounds, Biber Tumenov was just defending himself, yeah. not more. But there was a moment when Tumenov connected nicely with his uh, sharp left hook, and he hurt Amarov, but that was just one moment in the second round. No grabbing, no grabbing. That was a weird situation for yeah. Amarov, I think, well. Wicked some one know. minute to go in the second round. And what a nice fight! Another, another good round for Islam Amara so far. And the main thing for him that he did not let the opponent to hit him, he did not get any shots of Bibert Tumanov. Two big elbows from Bibert, by the way. But we see that Islam Amara did not react somehow on these shots, and he continues doing his job. And his job is to take Biber Tumenov down, to take the control of him. Well, nice elbow. Sharp elbow on another one. And it was a legal one. Not to the back of the head, but to the side of the head. So it's okay. It's good enough. And 10 seconds to go in the second round. And so far, this round goes under the belt of Islam Amaro. That's my idea. Definitely, I agree with that. What a nice... Whoa! Look at that! Tremendous slam from Islam Amarov! I don't believe my eyes! Oh my goodness! Super! Superb! Oh no! This kid is dangerous for everybody. Absolutely, absolutely, yes! I just cannot believe my eyes! What has she done? And... Uh, it's wondering for me how Biber Tumeno managed to survive after such kind of a throw and of such kind of a landing on the canvas. Let's see it once again. Boom! Whoa! Actually, he it's almost a, got on his neck. Yeah, yeah. It, actually, it's a five point in a freestyle wrestling. Well, it was dangerous yeah. enough and it could cause a big injury for Biber Tumeno, but. It was very similar with the fight uh, of Fedor Emelianenko and uh, Kevin, uh, Kevin Randleman. Randleman. Yes. Yeah. But the height was bigger. Yeah. Yeah. And the power of that uh, slam was bigger. So round number three and uh, previous two are already under the belt of Islam Amarov, who I considered to be a big underdog here, but he shows a perfect, perfect game, perfect game plan, splendid, tremendous tactics. And, uh, and right now, Bieber can be saved only by a knockout. Or a, so by a finish. By, by a finish. finish, yes. So, let's see. I don't, I don't think that he will go for a submission, actually. Well, but who knows? Well, it's an MMA yeah, fight. Sure. That's why we do love MMA. That a striker can surprise you in wrestling and grappling game. And look at this! Once again, Islam Omarov shows that he is a better wrestler and a better grappler than Biber Tumenov and much more better grappler. 
And look at this control shown by Islam Amara once again. And uh, so Bibet Tuminov has nothing to do but just to use the fans in order to get up yeah, and to continue fighting on the distance. He can definitely use it right now, but right now Amara is controlling his arm. That's why he is not able to stand up. He can't hold the fence, actually. Or and once again, the referee Bieber. will take a point. Yeah, so he mustn't do that. But I think that Bibet Tumenov wants to use any chance, a slight chance, to get up. And I look at Bibet Tumenov's corner at Albert Tumenov, and they are so disappointed. They are pretty sad now. Of because, course. Well, from this position, Tumenov is not able to knock his opponent down. Exactly. It's no chance. No Just chance. Not a slight chance. So. So far, a very, very solid game from Islam Amarov. Just destroying Bibert Tumenov and just destroying his strength. Not letting uh, Bibert Tumenov using his advantages, his skills. And look at this leg control. We call it Khabib's leg control. That was invented by yeah. Khabib Nurmagomedov during his fights against uh, Adson Barbosa and many others. Manov still in control. Amarov, I'm sorry, is in control. Takes his back. Well, Bibir Tumenov is struggling. He's struggling. He's trying to overcome these circumstances, but it's really hard for him to do it. Because, well, you know, for me, uh, Islam Amarov is like a spider or something like that. He grabbed the opponent with all his limbs and not letting and just choking and just destroying. Just waiting till the time expires and he will get his 10th victory yes perfect game plan perfect way he works and had a nice preparation for this fight super mentally control. and physically yes that is a, uh, that is a very important thing that islam amarov Step into the cage prepared physically and mentally. He was not afraid of Bibel Tumenov's power. He was not afraid of his strikes. And he did really knew what to do to escape him. He did really knew what to do in order to avoid his knockout power. Nice and so that is exactly what he did. And that is exactly what he is doing now. Yeah, he is definitely winning, but not in a seven stone yet. There is no true despair without hope for Tumenov he can still win this fight because we know that every knockout artist is very dangerous till the end of the fight right now he uses his elbows another knee to the hip from Islam Amarov and right now actually Amarov talks to Aslanbek Badaev, <laughs> the vice president of yeah. the ACA League. He asked how he is. Is everything all right? So yeah. it's similar to Khabib. Yeah, sure. Because like, Khabib used to talk to the corners, he used to talk to the commentators, to, and Dana, to White, Dana White, and to, to the opponents, because yeah. he was talking to him, saying, come on, man, you're nothing. Give up, give up. You have to give up. It's don't my waste fight. my time. Don't yeah. waste my. Don't waste your time. Just give up and let's stick to the point. Let's go to the dressing room. 30 seconds to go. There is no way to manage could separate from this position and stand up. And Bibe Tumen tried to say something. Yeah. He even put out the mouthpiece. Well, uh, I know why Bibi Tumenov is complaining, because he has nothing to do else. He cannot do anything in this fight. He yeah. was just destructed. He was just overwhelmed. He could not do anything with this kind of tactics yeah. provided yeah. by Islam Amarov, and that's it! Perfect this is the win. biggest win for, uh, for Islam Amarov in his career. So far, the biggest win, and he and he defeated. And pay attention on his striking game in the first round and the wrestling game in the second. Actually, what he produced, what he showed us today, it's a perfect way 
how every fighter should be preparing for his or for his or her fight. Exactly, and we see a huge disappointment on uh, Biber Tumanov's face, and we understand why, because he's a strong fighter. He's a really tough guy, but today he could not show it because yeah. of this man, of this youngster. Islam Omarov showed everybody that a very good, solid game plan and sticking to this plan can decide. So that is exactly what happened today in this cage. Just complete overhelming of Bebe Tuminov. Well, the only thing I can add to this fight that when we meet such kind of opposition a wrestler against the striker, to my mind, in 80% the wrestling decides. Of course, almost always. But today, Islam Omarov showed us that he is not only wrestler, he can definitely exchange in the striking game.